Brett back at you with ShySky.com. I'm here to show you how we're going to encapsulate our solar panel which we've just made. You can see our other videos. I'm going to tell you the material that I chose to actually seal this solar panel with and we found that this material is actually one of the better materials out there in regard to the epoxies or the slag art. It's actually extremely durable, it's easy to work with and the, the time is actually um, a very big advantage to this. I mean it's a very easy material to work with. Um, I'm trying to recall the actual name of it. It is actually an EVA solar cell type of film which you can pick up off of eBay or you can um, order it online and I will show you how I'm encapsulating this with that material. So stand by. Hi, here's the EVA material in which I'm going to encapsulate this solar panel with. Um, I'm going to lay this material on. As you can see, this material has a paper backing. The paper in itself is going to be removed prior to touching my solar panel. I like to actually start the removal of the paper first. So I want all my surfaces clean so I get a really good um, bond with the glass and the solar panel. So what I like to do is I'm actually going to take my paper and I'm going to go just like this. I'm going to give kind of a about a three inch roll. I'm going to flip it up over the solar panel in itself. And sometimes what you can do is you can have weight. is I'm just finishing up as you can see the one thing about uh, EVA is actually you want to keep going on glass until it just almost starts um, bubbling and it will give you a lot better bond to a glass surface or any other type of surface that you've got your cells resting on. Um, just for a note I haven't done it on this panel but I have done it on others is I've left the heat gun in a position, I mean, too long, and I have burned a hole through that. Don't be discouraged if that in fact happened. I will show you how I deal with that. We'll say if I had put a hole right there, I just cut a, a patch out of the material, and I'm going to lay it on my, my hole, and then I'm just going to hit it with the, the, the heat gun, and the two actually marry up and merge very well together as you can actually see here and you can patch any holes or any errors that you might have done using the, the, the EVA but the material bonds very well and this will be the completion of what I do do is on my edges you can see I like to get my edges extremely hot down here where they almost start dripping off and I do that just so I know that all my edges are bonded very well and then I'll take a razor blade and I'll clean up all my edges um, when I'm done with the panel. 